Good morning, everyone. I'm Shelby, and I'm a student at UNT. I'm a sophomore this year, and I'm studying business economics, and I thought it would be fun to bring you guys along for a day in the life. For my future college students out there, this is what I bring to class daily. What you'll probably most likely definitely need is, if I can open the pocket. <laughs> Another must have for a college student is some kind of laptop. I've seen people um, use iPads as well, but um, for me, this is my baby. This is where all of the work gets done. Since I'm a business student, it's also always helpful to get yourself a graphing calculator. And depending on what classes you take, if you're gonna need to take notes or if you could do it on Google Docs, et cetera. But those are the essentials. Um, UNT allows you to bike ride to class, to skateboard, and there's even those electric scooters that people zoom by me past, or zoom past me with. Um, but today I'll just be riding my bike. If you live in off-campus housing or like at Victory, like me, um, they have bus schedules that will take you to whatever building you need to get to on campus. All right, let's go. Wait, it's like it's, it's like recording. Yeah. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> Hey guys, I just got back from my B-Law class. I'm still in the BLB, or the Business Leadership Building. Um, and one thing I wanted to talk about is how much I really like the class sizes at UNT. Um, they're a lot more comfortable than I've heard of other universities. And even in my larger classes, the professor still makes sure that he's speaking directly with students and there's a lot of participation going on in those classes. Um, so I really appreciate that you feel heard. One thing that's very important to keep track of in college is just trying to stay organized throughout all of your classes with all of your extracurriculars and other obligations that you have to keep track of. I really enjoy the calendar feature on Canvas because it lays out all of the assignments that your professors have due for basically the entire semester and you can get a head start and look to see what those weeks are going to look like in the following weeks. <laughs> yes. There's a way that you can actually take the Canvas calendar and integrate it into your Google calendar. So what I do is to keep track of all my classwork, my work schedule, my outside extracurriculars, I'll take my Canvas calendar and put it into my Google calendar so I have all of my calendars in one area that I can look at. Another thing that I really appreciate um, about UNT is that all of my professors so far have been really great with communicating. And if I ever have been struggling in a class, they're always going out of their way to make sure that I understand the concepts that they're teaching. Whether that be me going to office hours or them offering me um, outside help, outside of office hours, um, they're always really good at communicating and they care about seeing the students succeed. My favorite study spots on campus, one would have to be the Willis Library, of course. They have four stories, it's open 24-7, so that's always the first option that me and my friends go to. Um, the second would probably be the BLB. I love this building, the architecture is just so nice. And the third story is always really quiet and peaceful up there. It's kind of like a maze back here because this is where the business professor's offices are. But if you can hear, it's super quiet and peaceful. <laughs> So this is where I always go. Don't everybody come up here all at once because then I won't be able to find seating. <laughs> if all else fails, the dorms always have really nice study rooms, mostly in every hall. Um, so there's lots of areas and resources that you can go to if you need to crunch for a test. A lot of students also don't realize that we have a writing center, a math lab. Those resources were very helpful for me whenever I was struggling in those classes, especially calculus. Don't be afraid to ask for help. They have one-on-one -on -one tutoring and, and they're really, really great if you need the help. You don't have to worry about trying to accommodate your really busy schedule. If you have time after class one day, you can just drop by and ask for help on a question that you had a question about and it's really great. And lastly, what I've come to love about UNT that nobody could have really explained to me beforehand is just the sense of community and the people at the university. And I think that is what has made my experience um, stand out like it has because it was really easy to find people that I clicked with and people that we can uplift and support each other, um, whether that be in clubs that I'm in or um, just people I've met in class. Everybody here 
has been very welcoming um, and it's really good to have that community and tighten it family feeling that UNT provides. Thank you all for coming to class with me today and I hope to see you guys soon on campus. Go Mean Green. <laughs>